Hello everyone, I'm Michelle. Welcome to another video. Today I want to show you what I made with the October Bargain Bead Box. And as soon as I looked at this month's box, all the beautiful color, the gold colors were really beautiful this month. And um, for some reason I just thought it screamed gold memory wire. Just because the gemstones are so beautiful and the elements are so beautiful that uh, you know there's really no need to do anything real fancy uh, other than just to showcase the beautiful beads so I took some neck some of the you know gold memory wire from Beadalon and it's a necklace of course uh, memory wire and then I just strung on the feather in the center um, I used the little rondelles, the little metal spacer beads, and then the 10 millimeter mukite in the front. I really wanted to showcase a beautiful gemstone. Then the three spacers, and then the smaller mukite. And then just to add a pop of lavender, I used the lavender uh, round glass beads, and then five more spacers. And then, um, because I didn't want it to slide around, I added a crimp bead right here at the ends. Here. It's real easy. You just, you know, bring it out, hook it around your neck like that, and you don't have to worry about losing it. Unless something would pull it, you know, really hard, pull it off. But So, I just loved um, all the gemstones that we got in this month's box. They're so gorgeous. So I just wanted to kind of showcase those in something simple but elegant. All right. And so I got the bracelet memory wire as well. Now all of this, um, I've taken pictures and I will add them, you know, at the end of this short video so you can really see this on a bust and up close and in you know, uh, hopefully really good lighting. Okay, so I used the chips, the Mukite chips, and I just, when as soon as I saw them, I thought of this. And then here, I used just two of the bead caps, side by side, so that they would look like a spacer bead, like a rondelle, fancy rondelle bead. Sometimes you get uh, those type beads on Jesse James strands and then of course the little spacers I added these little charms here and there you know for a little flash of metal and then you know I used <clears throat> some of the cream colored rondelles as well and the um, jasper and, and on the center row Sorry about that vehicle. And then on the ends here, of course, I curled it up and ended with some spacer beads. Looks really cute on. And see how close these, some of these um, charms are laying? Well, this, my arm, my wrist is not that small. So, you know, it stretch, it kind of stretches out and it places them in the right spots okay it's a three wrap it's a three wrap it's not a four All right so there's that and then I thought well why not continue with memory wire for the earrings so that's what I did here I am um, I just made some hoop earrings. Let me get them laid out. I made some hoop earrings with um, the memory wire, my own ear hooks. Um, at the top here, I put two crimp beads so the the ear hook didn't slide because I had to put a crimp bead anyway to hold these wires together. 
So I thought, well, why not make it two so that ear wire doesn't slide around the hoop. And then I used, of course, the beautiful Mukai in the six millimeter, the larger rondelles with bead caps, and um, the small spacer beads. Now for this drop here, I didn't get the number four, which is the um, leaf drops, you know, or the feather drops. So that's what I, the feather is what I definitely would have used here. Now they will, I, I emailed them, they'll send them to me, but I didn't want to wait to design some some things from this box. See the feather here, the feather, would it would look perfect with the feather on there. And I will probably make, once I get those, I'll make myself a pair with the feather to match. Because I love this, I really love this suite of jewelry. And the camera, my camera is not really doing it justice. I mean, I'm sitting here, I look at the screen, and then I look at down in real real life, and not even close. Not even close. But there we go. There's the <clears throat> suite of jewelry that I made from this month's box. I loved all the colors in this month's box they had such a great job and I'm so happy they paired this pretty gold not the real real bright but the pretty antique gold uh, with these colors beautiful 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 and if you're not already a member to the bargain bee box I'll put a link in the description box below this video um, and it'll save you two dollars off your first box all right, so that way you can come and make jewelry, same the same jewelry with us, okay? And so, um, like I said, I'll go ahead and and put up some pictures of uh, the jewelry on a bust, so you can see up close. All right, everybody, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.